Where do we come from? Who do we come from? Who am I? Who are they? Why do I look like the milkman? Ew! Who are these people? What's that? Am I a reincarnated poodle? These are just a few of the questions we help you to find the answers to as we uncover the never-before-seen branches of your family tree. These are the roots that give way to your past and to your future. Welcome to the Finding Your Genealogical Roots Roadshow. Today, we've traveled to El Paso, Texas, to the home of Jack and Mindy Cordova. He goes to spray tan like every other day. Yes. He's got, he likes to be bronze. Crunch. Um. He's tan. Yeah, it's tan is what it's called, I think. Not dark. It's not brown. Tan. It's tan. I've gotten calls from the neighbors, and they want to get my lawn service man and I realize they're referring to you. It's and because I'm brown? Well, you're bronzed, my okay. honey. And I really think that that might be beneficial for the whole neighborhood if we got a little um, really brown boy to do the lawn instead. This is kind of offensive. A little brown boy will make you look lighter. <laughs> and uh, um, I really do think that you should try that makeup I got you. What? Um, but it makes I me look like it. a ghost. It brings a porcelain glow. I know, but it's I look weird. I look like a like a white ghost, like a. Well, other parts of you are are white. <coughs> oh, hi. Hi there. Hey. Hi. How are you doing? We didn't see you sneak in. Hi. I'm sorry. We should, we should get started. Sure. Well, as you know, we at the Finding Your Genealogical Roots Road Show mm -hmm. rarely, if ever, travel to someone's home. Right. I know. <laughs> Kind of why don't you explain why? Yeah, ever since I was a, a little boy, my family said we were related to White Herb. And I wanted to find out for sure, you know, for my family's sake and stuff. <laughs> yeah. And our community. Yeah. So what'd you find? <laughs> well, why don't we get started? Okay. That's not White Herb. No. It? No, it's not. This is your great 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 grandfather who was actually Wyatt Earp's most obnoxious enemy. Oh. Archibald Joaquin Cordova, or as he was known at the time, the Limp Pistol Kid. Apparently a nickname given to him by one of the many prostitutes your ancestor tried to frequent. Oh god. But wait, there's more. There's more? Oh god. This is Abigail Horley Bent. She's your great 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 grandmother. Of course she is. Abigail, also known as the whore who brought syphilis to the West, was also apparently the prostitute who coined your ancestor's famous nickname. Okay, I'm out of here. No, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, you know, we should continue. We have a lot to cover. Sure, but, but could you give me a, a quick rundown so, you know, so I have some heads up, so I'm not shamed on national television? Of course. Yeah. Of course. Let's see what we have here. Let's see. Whore, 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 thief, whore, bandit, whore, lot of whores. Grave robber, tax collector, ah, used mule salesman. Oh. Look, an African-American slave's here. Maybe his family held a hand in the Underground Railroad and freeing all those African-American people? To the north. Up there. Go there. Go to away. Some, go I mean, away. Up there. To Minnesota. Back to those people. Yeah. Actually, oh. those 279 African-American slaves were owned by your great-great-great-great-grandfather, Aloysius Cordova, who single-handedly revitalized the wrestling widget slave trade. He also ran against Abraham Lincoln in a gubernatorial race backed by the Hail Satan Party. A slave owner and a modern-day Republican. Great. Oh, and boy, did he hate the Irish. Oh, that's... What else is there? Wait, well, wait, wait. <clears throat> how, about, how about my wife? Did you find anything about her side of the family? Uh, well, we actually did find something about your wife's there side of the go. family. Yes. That's, this, yeah. this is probably about, really why Just forget about my to side. Just yeah, throw my side what? out. We, just, we don't even... Abort, abort. Yeah, we'll just cut that out and get her side. 
first. Very You're good. related to a very famous painter. Oh. <gasps> Picasso or Monet? Oh. Of European descent. Picasso. Known by all. Picasso. Oh yes. Who started a movement. Jackpot. That moved comes. millions. Yes. He single-handedly brought a nation to their feet. Like okay. Jesus. At the same time, bringing another nation to their knees. You are a very close relation to Adolf Hitler. You say Hitler. Do you mean uh, okay. Adolf Lundgren? Adolf. Adolf. Hitler. Dolph Lundgren. Dolph Lundgren? Oh, Hitler. Yes. From Hitler. No, no, no. Uh, Rocky IV. Rocky no. IV. Was no, game. Hitler was wasn't in Rocky IV. No. I checked. Thank you for joining us, and tune in next time as we reveal the rest of the Cordova family tree. Hey! Does it get any better? Yeah. No. This week it's their family. Next week it could be yours. From all of us here at the Finding Your Genealogical Roots Roadshow, we'll see you next time. This was a bad idea. What about... Uh, Stop helping! This is definitely going to blueprints. So we're recording. It's the gag reel. It's one of the shows didn't know what they were doing. Hitler. Hit. The guy from World War Two. I don't think it's funny. I'm just asking. If we get the Volvo, it'll okay. make you look Swedish. Swedish. Is it a Swedish car? You mean whiter? Well, less. Um, tan. <laughs> Could be a different one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When I go out in the sun, I get darker. What's wrong with that? But you're so white in other areas. <laughs> oh, a dolphin bit. See, it's, there's different kinds. And I'm Mexican. So there's not going to be any white. I thought history. you just really like Mexican food. <laughs> wow. Gotta go. <laughs> Adolf Hitler. <laughs>